Hey, what's up? Six Tayo here, time to be showing you a tweak that I have been waiting for to uh, update to iOS 7 and uh, also a 7 64 bit support for since I last sold my iPhone 5 or traded it, whatever. And um, also got rid of my iPad Mini 1. And uh, yeah, it's a tweak that I've really missed uh, because it really makes a huge difference for me and uh, you know, how I use iOS on a daily or a day to day basis. So uh, let's just go ahead and show you what the tweak actually is. I can show you my, uh, my passcode. But um, it's called Swipe Selection. You get it from Cydia, and of course you do have to have a jailbroken device to get this. Uh, the way to get that is by, if you have a jailbroken device, and uh, if your iOS device is not jailbroken, just simply go to evasion.com. Uh, the link is in the description. And then, uh, let's see. Oh, hey, it's already up there. And then um, if you just type the word Swipes, or a swipe selection, whatever. It's uh, all one word in there. And it's uh, just typed just like so. You do not need to add any external repos or anything like that. Let me go ahead and focus in on this so you can see it a little bit better. Tap on it and then uh, click the little install thing at the top right and uh, confirm it. And then once it's installed, it will have your respring. Simply go back and we're gonna go ahead and go into the notes, which are right here. Now, obviously, I have a, new, a few other uh, tweaks installed too, but let's go ahead and uh, you know, use this as the example. So the way swipe selection works, you uh, let's see. Okay, so on the iPad keyboard, it's a little bit different, um, but not too much different if you're using it with an iPhone. But um, you know, if you uh, type a lot with uh, you know the iOS keyboard, you know, on-screen touchscreen uh, keyboard, then this will really uh, benefit you in many ways. So if you want to select something, I believe on the iPad keyboard, the uh, backspace button is for select, which yes it is. And that's uh, the same what it is on the iOS keyboard uh, for the iPhone. Then if you want to do uh, you know, just regular cursor movement and stuff like that, it's return to A or uh, uppercase to uppercase down here. That is also select, that is kind of weird. Hmm. I don't remember that, but whatever. So I guess the, uh, you know, the top and uh, second to bottom row is uh, for select. And then the uh, middle row is for cursor selection. And the uh, top row is for uh, you know, select. Hmm. That's kind of weird. So let's go ahead and do portrait mode. See if that's any different in any way whatsoever. So I guess the Q uh, you know, from the left to the right is uh, just uh, regular cursor selection and the, uh, yeah. Okay, so if you're in the middle of a word, uh, the way to get around that, uh, I really need to add my uh, extra keyboard to this thing. So if you wanna select one word, but you're in the middle of it, and uh, you want to select the whole thing without having to you know, touch hold and all that shit. Um, simply go through and select it one way and select it the other way, just like so. And that's how that is done. And if you want to just deselect everything, just simply tap anywhere. And that's how that works. Now, I haven't used uh, swipe selection with the iPad for a little bit, so I actually got a little bit used to it right now uh, you know, in the video. So uh, sorry about that for not being as as uh, prepared as I should have been. But um, yeah, there you go. That's swipe selection for uh, iOS on a jailbroken iOS. Now, honestly, this is one of my favorite jailbroken tweaks um, just because, you know, for a lot of people, the iOS keyboard is already perfect. You know, just the way it is out of the box. Um, for jailbroken users, you know, being able to change the type of keyboard that you're using or you know, put different colors and stuff like that, that makes it perfect for them. I don't give two shits about that. But uh, swipe selection, adding actual functionality to the keyboard, just makes it in every way possible perfect. Now, I do not know if there's an Android equivalent, but uh, you know, hopefully there is because Android users you know, really should use this because like the Samsung keyboard is absolute shit. Uh, the stock Google keyboard is good, but it's uh, it could use a lot of improvement. But um, iOS keyboard is in every way perfect with swipe selection. So I highly recommend uh, downloading it. It is a free uh, tweak. 
For some reason, my Stadia is crashing, and I don't know why that is. It did that once earlier today, and I uh, just did a respring, and that fixed it. But um, yeah, just go to Cydia, download it, and there you go. The uh, developer of this is uh, named iKyle, I guess is a nickname thing, or uh, Kyle Howells. Um, I would donate to him. I just uh, knocked something off my desk. I would go ahead and uh, donate to him, uh, just because this tweak is actually worth paying for. I honestly don't know why this isn't a paid tweak. If it was a paid tweak, I'd pay for it, but it's not. Which is uh, good news for you, uh, you know, for a lot of you who like to be cheap. Anyway, comment, rate, subscribe, follow me on Twitter at 6 Zero. If you have any uh, comments, questions, or anything like that, just let me know, and I will see you later.